Hi, today we're going to be reading Maple by Lori Nichols. Maple loved her name. When she was still a whisper, her parents planted a tiny tree in her honor. And even though Flava, Mary Jane, Lena, Lily, and Constantine were all good names, Maple was the perfect fit. And as Maple grew, so did her tree. Sometimes when Maple was very noisy, which was a lot, her parents would send her outside to play. Her tree didn't mind if she was loud. Maple would sing to her tree and sway for her tree and even sometimes pretend to be a tree. On some days, the wind was just right, and Maple would simply lie under her tree, and its leaves would dance just for her. Then one day, Mo Maple noticed her tree was bare. Maple was worried her tree might get cold. So Maple took off her jacket and gave her it to her tree to stay warm. Sometimes Maple wished that she had someone else to play with. The tree wasn't very good at throwing snowballs. She wondered if the tree felt the same way. So Maple introduced her tree to a friend. But the friendship didn't last. Maple and her tree still had each other. Through the winter and the spring. Then one day something surprising happened. Then something really surprising happened. Maple became a big sister. Maple tried to be a good big sister. If the baby was cold, she gave the baby her hat and gloves. If the baby was lonely, she would share her special friends. But Maple couldn't always make the baby happy. And when the baby was noisy, which was a lot, Maple would take her outside to play. And something magical happened. Maple's tree danced for them both. And there was enough room under the tree for Maple and her little sister Willow. Thank you all for watching. Come back next Sunday for another book. I hope you liked Maple. Subscribe, like, and comment. Goodbye.